you've been vocal about the importance of people being able to leave abusive relationships. And, and that's pretty cool. But I'm wondering, are you going, you're in a position to help me leave an abusive relationship. Would you be willing to help me? This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by... Nihongo hanashimasu ka? Nihongo hanashimasen? Veteran. I can hold this sign, right? You're holding it. Oh, but as a veteran. What? I beg your pardon? Oh, but as a veteran. I mean, I am a veteran. So that's why this means. Oops, wait a minute. I didn't have the wrong. Okay. Right? You know, this gentleman is not with the media. He's not with yeah. us. So, yeah. okay. so you know that. Okay. But I'm, I'm not with the media. Could you explain a little bit about why I'm not with the media? I'm not. And who are you? <laughs> she's. I think the reason she's talking, what she thinks she's trying to tell you is I'm a libertarian videographer, right, right, I have right, a bias. Right. Uh, <laughs> right. So she's afraid that I might make you look yeah, bad. So you guys would know that the, um, these guys are the Free State Project, so they're going to cut film and try to take your reports out of context. So. Well, could, you, could you repeat that, Zandra? <laughs> <laughs> what exactly are you accusing me of being about to do? Actually, I have a question for you. Um, you have been so guys, vocal. I just want to give a quick heads up that we do have a tracker here from Citizens for Strong New Hampshire behind us, and this fellow's with the Free State product, so we'd suggest that you don't engage with them and encourage that behavior. Hey, folks, can I get your attention real quick? I just want you to know that we have a tracker here from the Free State Project and also from Citizens for Strong New Hampshire, so we'd encourage you just not to encourage them by um, you know, doing video footage with them. But you'd probably say... You could do that. I could do that. <laughs> yeah, you guys probably right in line. <laughs> but thank you for pointing that out. I, I would do the same thing for you guys. <laughs> you ready to catch that? Um, this fellow's here from the Free State Project, and um, the fellow in the green and blues was citizens for a strong New Hampshire, so we'd encourage you not to um, encourage them by you know, speaking with them on camera. Thanks. Now, Zandra, you've been vocal about the importance of people being able to leave abusive relationships, and, and that's pretty cool, but I'm wondering, are you going... You're in a position to help me leave an abusive relationship. Would you be willing to help me? Or at least maybe doing less to keep me in an abusive relationship? Would you be willing to reduce the stuff that you do that keeps me in an abusive relationship? You want a drink? You good? Can you guess what organization I'm in an abusive relationship with? I'll answer the question for you. It's the government. Are you willing to help me end my abusive relationship with the government? Or do you only are you only against abusive relationships when there are private citizens involved? So this is the guy, I guess they were accusing him of being with some organization that doesn't like what they're doing. <laughs> we'll see. All right, well anyway, there's a look at the crowd from across the street. What Zandra has sort of done uh, is given me the opportunity, I guess it was not going to be that interesting here until she started trying to, uh, I don't know, uh, keep people from talking to me. She and I have actually known, you know, of each other or been around each other for a pretty long time. She knows exactly what I do. I don't know if I would call it tracking. 
Anyway, what I had wanted to do was to uh, talk to some people who have some maybe some good questions that I could ask Senator Bragdon in an ambush interview. I will still try to do that and get some good questions and still try to ambush interview them if I get a chance. But opposing me kind of slows me down in that respect. If they want my money, they're my business. So that's definitely a good shot that I would like to have in my archives when I'm talking about the welfare state. I can't imagine people seeing or believing something like this. Okay, so yeah, this gentleman, uh, you know, he's, he's indicated to me that he uh, cannot talk to me except off the record. So he's obviously with some, he's with some kind of opposing organization. But he's not an indie like me, he's working for somebody. So there's not a whole bucket load of transparency today, but we'll work with it. So are you the one that's not afraid to talk? I, I'll take that as a no. <laughs> they, they, I got the impression from them that you were not afraid to talk to me. Is that correct? No, what would you like to talk about? Oh, awesome. Oh, just, the, just the issue, I mean, of, of whether or not uh, New Hampshire should be taking more money from the federal government. Uh, I think that a lot of people should not be taking as much federal money from the federal government as they're already taking. This is just one component of that. Oh, so you're you're here as a counter protester? Oh, okay. I didn't catch that at first. All right. There you go. Well, I I will talk to people who I disagree with. Uh, there you go. But I'll talk to you too. Um, yeah. So this, uh, uh, gentleman right there is a very good friend of mine, and he's always got the other side of the coin. And, but he's still a very good friend of mine. Oh, the person you're standing next to. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, it's a good guy. Right. Uh, do you find it kind of curious that there are so many counter protesters here? I mean, cause, I mean, I'm I'm a considered a libertarian videographer, and that guy over there apparently is tracking them. They say. Um, I don't know about that. And uh, so. It's, you know, he, he wouldn't really give me much information about what he was doing. But uh, I'm, I'm not used to going to a demonstration and seeing counter demonstrators. This is New Hampshire. <laughs> this is New Hampshire. You're supposed to be able to express yourself. You heard the joke, well, you think the presidential candidate X, Y, or Z? I know, I have met the person four times. Nowhere in America can you say that. We're very proud of that in New Hampshire. And we can still be on opposite sides of the coin and be friends. Did you uh, like the way Zandra handled her interaction with other people trying to keep them from going on camera? Do you think that was appropriate or not appropriate? I don't or? know who Zandra is. Oh, the, the lady that was coming up and trying to keep people from going on camera. It's interesting that somebody that was a Democrat was trying to control the press. Well, I wouldn't go that far. I don't. I think she might have been trying to control the outcome a little bit. She's not trying to stop me from filming or anything like that. Yeah. But, okay. I appreciate hey, your time. You can day. give me whatever part of your name you want. No, I'm, I'm Ken from Concord. All right, Ken. Thanks so much. Have a great day. You too. Yeah, he's wearing a bigger car now. Just more, more stickers on. There you go. Thank <laughs> <laughs> I'll make it easier for you. Oh, yeah. That guy. I'll make it easier for you. That's a great thing. There is something that they want to say. Is this one? Yeah. You know how I'm always talking about the fact that if you go to the state house and you swing your fist, you hit a member of the New Hampshire Liberty Alliance. Well, I've never actually showed you any video of the, 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 the way the New Hampshire Liberty Alliance is able to just pack the state house full of liberty activists. Take a look at this. On this day, we had about 30 activists, I think, to fight for more freedom in New Hampshire and prevent the state house from passing bad bills. There have been times where we've had more like 50. Here they are meeting with the governor the same day. And they've had quite a bit of legislative success, too. That's why I'm a member of the New Hampshire Liberty Alliance, and hope you will be, too. Find out more at nhliberty.org. nhliberty.org.